What's up guys, I'm Addison the Double Cheeseburger and today we're trying out Jack Daniels Country Cocktails. So I tried this one already so far. The Lynchburg Lemonade. It was actually quite yummy. I think I gave it a 7.4 and it's going to be a first to try all these. And let's see if they're yummy or not yummy. So that was Watermelon Punch. It's pretty good. It reminds me of a... Uh... Sorry, I had that one open already. I had to reset the camera, but... Man, it reminds me of uh, those big icy popsicles they used to have. There used to be a dollar. And the big frozen, like, tubes. They're pretty much like giant otter pops. That would, that's what that tastes like. Second up, we got Southern Peach. That one's okay too. I feel like you really do get the hint of JD though, or Jack Daniels after. But man, I don't like either watermelon or peach flavored, you know, things. So that kind of sucks. But I give these like at least above a six. Let's try Down Home Punch. So I'm guessing it's just like a normal fruit punch. Yummy! That one tastes like an actual cocktail. Like a Mai Tai or I don't know what uh, mixed drinks there are that are fruit punch based, but that's how that tastes like. And now the classic Lynchburg lemonade, which I had already. That one just tastes like a lower ABV Mai Tai lemonade. These are 4.8% ABV. I don't know the price point Mrs. Cheeseburger got them, but uh, yeah, I've been seeing these around for a while now. So today we brought out the Das Boot though. Let's make our own cocktail of these country cocktails. We got the peach going in first. Sorry about that, triggers. Had to delete some storage on my, make some room on my phone. All right, so we just got the peach one in though. Now let's get the watermelon in there. Some pretty vibrant colors. What kind of sucks though about all of them so far is that they do taste really like artificially. <laughs> Artificial, like you could taste the, the chemicals in there, I don't know. It's not very flattering. It feels like you're drinking those dollar juices, but like with alcohol. All right, now time for the last one. Lynchburg lemonade. So four beers, or you know, four 12 ounces, 48 ounces, like two tall cans, not bad. Oh wait, these are only 10 fluid ounces too, what a rip off. I knew the bottle seemed a little off too. For them only being 10, uh, 10 ounces, the ABV should be a little stronger, I feel like. But yeah, let's see. Uh, I don't have anything to stir it with, but let's see what all of them mixed together taste like. That's really just like a giant punch now. Now one flavor peaks through more than the other. I would say I get like after hints of the watermelon flavor, but overall it's pretty yummy. I think I like them mixed all together than each one individually. And I don't know if I ranked the punch one, but this was probably the best one I thought. And then second, the normal lemonade. And these two I said were just above a six, so just mediocre. But all mixed together, I'd probably give this a solid 7.9. Just minus the uh, stomach ache factor because of how sweet this is. Let's finish this bad boy off. I'm not, I'm not going to try to do it in one go, but I'm going to sit here and finish it with you guys. See if I get any more notes as I go further down the boot. Notes of these other flavors.
can't pin it down what it tastes like, but it reminds me of some kind of candy or something. I will say though, that that second sip I just had, I didn't even get a hit of the watermelon like I did on the first sip. So I'm going to call this Jack Daniels Country Cocktail Cocktail. Or medley. I don't know what to call this. Yeah, this sucks. I feel like I'm going to get a sugar stomach ache already. But overall, pretty fun. I mean, something way different. Not, not up our alley. I feel like, uh, I don't know. I feel like maybe these aren't catching on as well. Because I feel like I've seen them for a while, but... I don't feel like I've seen anyone actually buy them at the store or drink them. They always seem to be in stock. Not these variety packs per se, but I've seen some in the cans, like tall cans already.